Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome, make sure you hit that subscribe button. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a taste test, first impressions of the Coke with a hint of orange flavour, um, no sugar. So, Coke has been releasing some limited edition flavours, first it was the raspberry, I didn't really care for that, um, then I have the ginger, again, didn't really care for that, then I did actually did a video on the coffee and coke just because I thought that was just such a big combination compared to raspberry or ginger. I feel like those are combinations that had really happened before whereas coke was kind of like a wow this is a first so if you want to see what I thought of that one I'll leave a link to that video but today I'm going to be testing out the orange one. Um, I thought that this one was definitely another interesting one um, because there are so many orange drinks out there but there's no coke orange like this Fanta and like Sunkist and like all those sorts of orange drinks but like not a cola orange you know what I mean so I'm definitely keen to see if this one tastes any good so yeah let's get into it so first I'm just going to go through what Coke has to say about this launch um this is has been around for a little bit um so I'm kind of late on the bandwagon but um this was released for winter and as we have just left winter we are coming into spring here in australia this is kind of like the end of its sort of limited edition time so you know if you've probably got a little bit more time for you to try it maybe in a couple of months i'll bring out the next one you know how australia is in the limited edition flavors we just can't get enough of limited edition flavors <laughs> um but yeah the marketing director of coke said that the hint of orange flavor provided a tasty winter alternative to the slice of lemon or lime that traditionally garnishes a Coke. So um, with the cool months setting in, Coca-Cola No Sugar offers Australians an exciting and invigorating new flavor that will be a great addition to get-togethers or meals with friends. Um, this limited edition flavor has been crafted for Australians with, and the spirited way we do the winter season. Um, fun and sociable. Um, we're not afraid to get the woolies on, grab our friends or family, and get out and about when it's chilly. So we've created a refreshing and unique drink to match. So I feel like that's kind of not really explaining it at all. Um, I know with co the coffee, um, as I mentioned in that video that I did, there was a lot more behind the reasoning. I think they were just running out of ideas. Um, I'm keen to see what other ideas, um, but like I, I do get it, you know, Coke is usually served with a lemon or a lime. I've never seen it garnished with an orange, so I guess I feel like this drink, I haven't tasted it yet, but I feel like it's going to be, you know how you have like the soda fountains and like you can press the button and the drink comes out into your cup? I feel like it's going to be if some naughty kid mixed Coke and Fanta together. That's just what I feel like it's going to taste like. Um, but yeah, I'm assuming they're not trying to rip off Fanta. Like, it is their, it is within their own company. So I guess having this orange flavor is already something they didn't have to research because they already had. I guess they just had to mix the two and see if it tasted okay. Um, yeah. Let's get into this because I'm so keen. It's been sitting in my fridge for a few weeks and I've been just waiting for the moment where I was like, okay, I have time to film it. Let's try this. So let's try it. It has a sweet smell, not like a Coke smell, but it's, it's a little, it, you can tell it smells like Coke, but it smells like Sunkist and Coke, not like Fanta and Coke. Sunkist is slightly different to Fanta. If you are Australian, you would know this, but I can definitely, or is it a Sunny Boy? Like an orange Sunny Boy, those triangle ice, ice box that used to be around when I was a kid. Yeah, it smells like an orange Sunny Boy. see you can't taste it's not a lot of orange it's it is like a hint like a garnish i don't know what fanta and orange taste like mixed together i've never done that because i'm normal but i imagine that that's what it would taste like it's not bad i do like this and i would drink it I wouldn't necessarily go out and choose to buy it as my number one 
sort of soft drink choice but if it was presented to me i would happily accept it and drink it it's not like the coffee coke um i'm not gonna spoil my opinion on that one you go check out that video but i don't mind it it's it's okay i can't taste the coke like it tastes like coke but the orange kind of masks the taste of the coke but it's not an overpowering orange it's like a hint of orange uh, it's hard to explain it's kind of like a dirty hint <laughs> Yeah, it's kind of like someone mixed a Coke and a, a Sunkist, but it's Coke no sugar, so it doesn't have that, like when I have Coke, it's overpoweringly sugary, so I usually go for Diet Coke. Um, if Coke Zero is available, I'd probably get it, but I'm more of a Diet Coke person, not because of sugar or caffeine or calories or anything like that, it's just personal preference of taste i prefer the taste of diet coke preferred to coke no sugar so this is actually coke no sugar with orange not coke with orange but there's not really an aftertaste i know the coke with coffee had a really big aftertaste but it doesn't have an aftertaste which i prefer um but yeah it's it's really interesting because it's like a weird sun kissed. It's like a, a half strength sun kissed, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, if you haven't tried it, make sure you go out and try it. It's not bad, so I think it's worth a try. Like, if you're gonna go and like try it, get like a little can like I did. Don't go get like the full size can, but just get the little 250 ml, like have a few sips with your mates, and I think it's interesting it's like a dirty sun kissed it's not a full strength sun kissed it's like a watered down sun kissed where you don't get that as big of a hit of orange it's just it's lingering it's there and i don't really taste the coke a lot it's mostly like a dirty sun kissed like someone went to the coke fountain and did a little bit of the coke no sugar or coke zero and then dumped a bit of sun kissed in there and maybe some water and that's what i think it tastes like it's not awful it's not bad but it's not like it's mind-blowing i have to have this again but yeah i i don't mind it i would happily drink it so yeah if you like this video make sure you give a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next one see you guys